What's up, what's up? Six Sense A here bringing you a gameplay I got last night in the live stream, which was Sunday night. This is going to go up on Tuesday, the day after my montage teaser trailer goes out. And that's kind of what I want to talk a little bit about today. The montage teaser trailer. I edited this montage. I'm super proud of it. And uh, I just can't wait to bring it to you guys. The reason I'm doing a teaser is because I kind of want to build that hype train, baby. I kind of want to get get people excited for this shit. Because, I mean, not a whole lot of people get excited for Call of Duty anymore. And I felt like I had an opportunity to maybe get a, a couple people excited. So, I'm happy about that. And this dude just panic smalls me. I don't know. I've been seeing a lot of smalls lately in, a fucking, in Drop Zone. But anyway, ton of stuff to talk about today, so let's get right to it. This gameplay right quick, like I said, I got it last night in the live stream. If you want to check out the clip that's uh, in the live stream, um, in its version with the reactions and everything, there's a clip in this gameplay uh, later on. It's it's also a 48 and 10, but there's a clip in this gameplay. Um, it's a triple headshot feed. I'll put the link in the description below. You can go check it out with all its uh, reactions and everything like that, because those are always fun, right? Reactions. Um but anyway, this game plays 48 and 10. It's like I said, it's got that clip in it. And these guys, the enemies were a bunch of freaking tryhards. Last game, we actually got defeated, I believe. Because they just wanted to play the objective real hard. So what we were trying to do is early on try to try to kind of beat them to the objective and, and gain ground so we can have a good lead. And then play around the objective in order to let them funnel up and get our kill feeds. It's kind of the whole idea of things. And that's pretty much what we like to do. So I'm picking up this uh, airstrike right here just in case they try to take another objective. I can bust them off of it. But back to the montage talk, baby. I'm so excited about this thing. I mean, it's going to be... It's going to be just a hell of a lot of fun, you know, to, to bring it out and see the see the comments and see people's reactions. Because I think I got pretty damn good clips in there. And I think that uh, the editing is clean, right? This is one of the things I got. I edited myself in Sony Vegas. And I fully understand and fully realize that there's a thousand, there's probably, there's thousands of editors out there that, that could do a better job um, in After Effects. And they could probably have done it faster, right? This took me probably 12 hours to edit this, which is one of the reasons I wasn't not able to bring you guys a commentary uh, in the last week because I was just pounding away at this montage, just trying to put the clips in, get the editing done, and, and things like that. And I'm, I'm proud of the way it come out. I'm happy with it. And the other thing is not only does it have clean editing, not too much cinematics and things like that, that leads to a fast pace. You know, the song I found was four, four minutes long, a little over four minutes, and it... uh. It's a fast-paced song. I wanted the I wanted the the shots and the clips. I wanted everything to go with that, um, and I wanted it to go perfect. So I, I'm happy the way it come out. I'm happy the way everything synced. Um, it's just it's it's in my opinion, right? It's gorgeous. Um, this is it's fast-paced, right? The four minutes fly by uh, before you even know what happened, and 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 the montage is over, and you're just like, wow, really, really was that four minutes of nonstop Call of Duty madness? <laughs> That's pretty much what it is. So, I mean, I just, I'm excited to bring you about it. And another reason that I was uh, pr pretty much unable to bring you guys another commentary last week is that I can finally announce to you guys, I kind of knew it was going to happen, but I can finally announce to you guys that I got a promotion at work. Um, I, w I guess I could go in a little more detail about it, right? It ain't no big deal. I work for the Coca-Cola company. Um, it looks CD Cyclone was trying to get a triple headshot for you, but I work for the Coca-Cola company and, uh... As of right now, I'm an account specialist, a lead merchandiser. Uh, a merchandiser is someone who fills the shelves, right? Uh, they go in and they just fill the shelves and and and, and organize things, and, and that's pretty much it. And it's the entry level position. I'll tell you what, though, it's a pretty badass entry level position for you know people without um, you know degrees and shit like that. I mean, the money you can make doing something like that is is not bad, and the career path ahead of you is also not bad. Um, I've built my life and my family based on this and, and my wife's income, which is, which is, you know, it helps a lot. <laughs> um, and so I got one promotion from merchandise. I started out as a regular merchandiser and then I became, let's air quote this, a glorified merchandiser. Basically just a little more pay, a little more responsibility, you know, a little more trust, if you will, things like that. And then finally I get promoted into a salesman. Now this, the other jobs that I mentioned, merchandiser and lead merchandiser, account specialist, whatever, glorified merchandiser, um, those take a lot of work, a lot of physical labor going on in there. I mean, seriously, a absolute ton of physical labor. Um, Backbreaking work is, is what it is. I mean, you're lifting Cokes and drinks and the shit's heavy. You know, you do this shit all day long and it, it, it becomes cumbersome on your body. You know, you get wore down and that's just the, the simple fact of it. Um, now I finally get to step out of that and I get to step into a sales role 
and that means I walk in and out of stores with a little computer in my hand, looking a little more fancy, no more uniform nonsense, and uh, you know, I, it's a big deal for me because the money's better. Right, I get weekends off, uh, bonuses, a car allowance. I, this is a huge deal, and to the point where the last person that stepped out of my role where I stand now into the role that I'm getting coming up. Four years ago is when this happened. As Twitter goes off on my phone, like like I said, I'm recording this mon this uh, commentary soon after the montage uh, trailer went up. So shit's going nuts right now. You know, getting a lot of tweets, a lot of comments, a lot of notifications here and there. So sorry about that. But nonetheless, we'll mute that phone right quick. Um, yeah, I'm just excited about this new job. You know, it's the same company, just a promotion. It's fantastic. It's it's uh, it's it's just it's so exciting. You know. To be able to do this, like I said, I get weekends off with my family. How huge is that? That's freaking monumental. Honestly, it really is. And uh, it's it's going to mean a lot. <laughs> I'm trying to line up headshots because the game before this one, CD Cyclone, uh, you might have noticed earlier he got a two headshot feed. He's using an RSASS, which I cannot use that gun for the life of me, but he actually did really well with it this game. Um, I think he was just trying for another headshot feed, but... Uh, uh, he went like f over 40 kills and right at 10 deaths, you know, just like I did with the MSR going full on tryhard. So, I mean, we got a bunch of six snipers in the clan, dude. I mean, there's some some people that blow you away They're much better than me. Honestly, no bullshit. I was around that corner. Damn you. I'm sorry. I didn't want to rage in the commentary. <laughs> but, uh, he must have had host pro or connection pro or whatever you want to call it. But anyway. Uh, yeah, dude, he, he asked me the game before this in the live stream. He said, hey, sensei, you should go for a uh, you should go for a triple headshot feed. And I was like, "Nah, I don't really do that. But all right, you know, why not? It's it's the it's the it's the live stream and I might as well give it a whirl. And uh, this very next game, swear to God, the very next game, I seized an opportunity to uh, to do just that and get a little triple headshot feed. And uh, I got a couple in the montage right now. It's not something I go for, like I just said. Um, I got one that's got like a no scope or two in it. I don't really know. One's like a half scope, black scope. The other's like a no scope, and the other's a quick scope. So it's three shots. This dude sucks. I wanted his gun. I wanted to just show him how to use it, and uh, you know, I, it didn't work out too well. I hate the L11. I want to love that gun so much. I really want to like it, but the freaking fire rate sucks so bad that you can't. Like if you get a hit marker in a shitty situation, you just can't repeat fire. Look, I should have shot right there. I pulled the trigger. It didn't work. The gun's a turd. Honestly, but <laughs> but anyway, uh, yeah, I got like one triple headshot feed in the montage, and I have a other, I have like one, maybe two other triple headshot feeds, um, in the life of Call of Duty that I have here, but um, they're hard scoping, right? I got one with the Barrett 50 cal, just looking down an alleyway, hard scoping triple headshot. Who wants? Do you really want to see that? I don't submit that you do, but right here, if you look at the mini map, I see the enemy. I see the enemy moving in, and here we go. One, two. And three. And theater mode, theater mode seems to f screw things up a little bit. If you go watch that with the link in the description to Triple Headshot Feed with all of the all of the reactions and everything like that, you'll see um, I really did have to line those up, and they were legit headshots. A uh, little celebration right here because, I mean, it's just, a fuck, it's just a ton of fun, you know? It's just a ton of fun as, uh, as Skype now goes off for me. <laughs> you got to love it. Like I said, I just released a... The thing and I didn't mute everything so whatever you know who cares who cares this is just a sit down this is just conversational right you guys talk to me but the new intro is fantastic I want you guys to tell me what you think about it um lawless made it lawless made that logo and it is just you know some of the shit he comes up with blows me away and maybe maybe I don't look at GFX enough but he tells me I say hey we need to do you know we need, need to get this shit out to the world and he's just like eh I don't know, I, you know, whatever. I think he's, I think he's got the creative talent. He feels like he's got some more skills he needs to learn, but I know the creativity is there. This dude's sick, sick with creativity, and I, you know, if he gets to a confidence level, I just can't wait to see what he's going to produce for us. It's just so exciting um, to see what he's going to do. And right here, the game's kind of coming to a close. What we like to do here, just just for an example, is uh, we like to get the the points up to about 7,400, and then we'll go for a kill cam. And um, we'll go for a kill cam, and then we'll end the game if we run into full party. Now, look, everybody just died. Where are they spawning? Behind me. Look behind me. Here they're spawning. I know where they're spawning because I played the game a lot. Boom. That should have been one. There's two. That's three. And I probably could have had four for the quad feed with that piece of turd gun. 
But nonetheless, payback for your ass. And now it's time to go for the kill cam. And unfortunately, we didn't get the time. We didn't get the score up enough, so we just had to wing it and try to go for a kill cam with the with the uh, with the actual timer. So there's your kill cam. That's all. That's all we're gonna get. I could have had one more shot right here, but I don't think it would have been worth it anyway. So nonetheless, here's your kill cam. If you could leave me a rating, tell me like, t tell tell me you like the video. You know what I'm saying? And uh, that's it for me. I'm Six Sensei, and I'm out. Peace.